Okay, tell me what you built. Um, so this is our Blimp FO. Your Blimp FO. Yes, that is the name of our project. Okay, so there's three balloons, each one of which is maybe a meter in diameter. It's 36 inches. 36 inches. And then down on the floor, there's three propellers controlled by an MCU. Um, the MCU is connected by I2C to our remote unit. All these these three components are powered separately. All right. So you have the remote unit is a is a, a radio, yeah. and, and and you're sending some sort of code over the radio from the from this guy. from this little dongle transmitter that you have in your hand over there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So fire it off. And there's Let's... also an accelerometer, so it self writes itself. If it starts to tip, it'll turn on the necessary motors. To... Oh, to keep it level. Uh -huh. And there are eight LEDs around the outside which indicate direction, so it will start with this is forwards. Okay, so... So that's going forwards now, and if we were to, if we want to turn, or if we want to go off... Up, up. So this is off. To turn, you can see the LED cycles around, Uh huh. and then you can, um, so... Uh, Based on the direction, you can either go forwards or backwards. Okay, so you get some sort of vector thrust there. Right, and there's more, it's a, it's a continuous thing. It's not one of eight directions. But we only have eight LEDs because we don't Sure, have, yeah. You know. And okay. so if, I'll, I'll press the down key, which will turn off all the motors. And you can see now it's just doing the self-writing. So if so, you tip it this way, it'll turn on that motor. Oh, I see, so... So, so this so, means it's not Okay, tip it just a little bit more. Oh, I see. So, okay. And so, if we try to tip it towards Jim, those ones will turn on. Uh huh. And if we turn it this way. Got it. Similarly, from like. So, right now, this is the forward direction. So, if we try to go backwards, then it will go that way, which means this one will turn on the strongest, and these two should decrease. Mm -hmm. And so, oh, yeah, right. So, here's backwards. And it should go this way. Up, up, up. I have not gotten very good at control on this. <laughs> well, the, so the, the control is kind of non orthogonal, right? So you gotta do a lot of thinking to figure <laughs> out. There's also um, only four buttons but six features, and so many of them are done by pressing two buttons. Caramba. So. <laughs> All right, so try and make it go towards uh, towards me over here. Where's the light? It's over it's towards. It's, it's, uh, it's in the correct Lincoln. direction. Yeah. Oh, okay, so we'll go forwards. Up. 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 <laughs> okay. So I think we the batteries die over time, so we might have to take out some ballast. So we all take out a ketchup pack, and then we can go forwards. And indeed it is. And then you turn with the... <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and so, yeah, how do you turn now? You, you, you... So you cycle through here. So the lit LED is now there. And we should mm -hmm. be able to... Cycle. Oh, you cycle through the LEDs. That's, that's why it's eight directional. Got it. We can go... Forward is defined as uh, the one with the LED. one vector, yeah. uh -huh. and we display on the LED where the closest direction is. Okay. Okay, take it up and take it down now for a minute. All right, this should be off. Is the radio I having issue? I think we're losing it. We have, I think. Sometimes this thing just loses connection. The battery has some... I got it. Yeah. Alright, we're back. So this is off? Yeah. Okay, now down. This is down. It'll drop. And then I think we're going to do... Okay, up now. <laughs> we don't have much. <laughs> yeah. 
And so right now, when it's in standby mode, it does the self-balancing. So right. So move, if, if we move the weight around, it should still... So make... this meant that you didn't have to be very careful about where you put the batteries or anything. Correct. You just, yeah. it just always balances. That's in, maybe in two directions, it's possible to balance it with you know, yeah. something like this, yeah. but three. And the, the great thing about three motors is that whatever direction we want to go, we can, we can go there with the same force. Mm -hmm. Because like... Even if it's between like some 27 degrees, we can go exactly as strong as zero degrees. So what do you think your payload is? How much are you lifting here? Uh, we spelled not have a scale. 1.5? Kilograms? I think so. Something like that. Well, well it looks without, without the balance. I'm not sure about the balance. The because bag is entirely balanced. It serves no purpose. Over here. Yeah, I can try to agree. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, good. All right, it changed direction. This is coming towards me now. And then let me pull up a bit. And then I'll bring it up a little bit. And we can go down. And we can cycle around. You can see the LEDs going around the ring. And mm -hmm. I'll try to bring it to you now. Up for a different Oh, up. yeah, up. Oh! <laughs> it's working. It's going up. Okay, take it back to you now. Alright. So we wait till it cycles around. There it is. And so now I go forward. And up. up. Break, break, break. Cool. <laughs> it's got some momentum. 